Welcome to this channel. Today we'll determine whether ozone is a greenhouse gas or not. The answer is yes, ozone is a greenhouse gas. Let me explain you what is uh, why ozone is a greenhouse gas. Okay, so let me introduce with you what is the definition of greenhouse gas. Greenhouse gas is a gas that do two things: it absorbs and emits uh, air radiation. Right. So here is a strategy to behave as a greenhouse gas either the molecule must possess a dipole moment to have dipole moment the molecule must be polar right ozone is a polar mo molecule remember uh, some or some of its vibrational motion must generate a temporary dipole moment on the other hand carbon dioxide is a non uh, linear molecule and it uh, it it net dipole moment is zero right but due to bending vibration of carbon monoxide uh, carbon dioxide uh, we get change in dipole moment that is why uh, carbon dioxide is air active or greenhouse gas however if you don't know about the dipole moment dipole moment uh, is the product of charge and the distance between charge if uh, distance means here the bond length if bond length changes in a polar molecule uh, then the dipole moment will be changed and it will be air active or greenhouse gas okay let me uh, give you more basic idea so that you can have more or less when two atoms of a diatomic molecule are having different electronegativity they generate a dipole moment molecule with dipole moment absorb the radiation from the infrared region, region and set the vibrational motion due to fluctuation in the bone this increase the vibrational energy such molecular air active or or air active molecular greenhouse gas simple diatomic linear polar molecule like carbon monoxide have only one mode of vibration that is the tracing and construction of bond Thus, heteronuclear polar molecules like HCl, Cu, and are air active. However, our uh, main target uh, is to explain uh, explain uh, about uh, about uh, ozone, right? Okay, ozone. We can write ozone like this, right? this is ozone right ozone has band shape right due to presence of lone pair right due to presence of lone pair ozone has band shape or v-shape and due to the v-shape was ozone molecule is a polar molecule actually experiment has shows that uh, ozone doesn't have any double bond you know that the bond length of this is shorter than the single bond that is why uh, uh, that is why this structure is not correct actually uh, lone pair over oxygen right lone pair uh, over oxygen lone pair over oxygen will delocalize delocalized from from this oxygen to this oxygen so this is the structure of ozone right this is the structure of this is a uh, this is the hybrid resonance structure of ozone right so i i think you have the knowledge how to write the resonance structure so since uh, ozone is a bending molecule so to get vibrational mode we will apply this formula 3n minus 6 here n is the atomic number so 3 times 3 in ozone we get 3 atom minus 6 that is 9 minus 6 that is 3 in case of ozone we have three vibrational mode like water right look at this the, this is the vibration of uh, ozone for this vibration we are getting 
the change is bond length if bond length changes then the dipole moment will change if dipole moment change during vibration then the molecule will be aeractive and aeractive molecule is greenhouse gas so we can say that ozone is a greenhouse gas i will have a blog post in the description box of this video you can read that blog post so thank you for being this video be well